This is Lonnie Hanson out here in the field. We've just finished this beautiful home in Cherry Hills Village, Colorado. And I'm gonna walk you around and show you a few of the things that we've used in this installation. I'll start with these G, the GKI um, four inch LEDs. We used LEDs throughout this project. We used light nets. Um, and in the case of the, this fountain, we used uh, GKI Pro um, garlands and cascading curtains woven in to the structure so that the fountain is not just sitting there empty for the whole thing. We put a 60 inch wreath in the window with a structural red bow and then this bush has a light net on it as well as some C7s. Here we have the six foot uh, candy cane. We've actually buried that in the mulch and the rock so it really feels like it's just teetering on its end. We have the resin ornaments, the flat back three foot resin ornaments. We've used light nets on the various shrubs, string lights in the small shrubs. And behind me, we're using the G40 uh, round filament bulbs, novelty, um, and the cascading curtains, the 19 and a half foot cascading curtain. We started at about midway, uh, traced it down the back, and then wove it all the way up and out. So we get that up and out cascading look. So again, we've used the 60 inch wreath with the red structural bow attached to the bottom. We guide it out uh, into the ground on the right and left. And then I wanna show you what we did with that three foot base that we couldn't use on the tower tree on the interior. Here we are. So remember that three foot base that we couldn't use because the tree was just gonna get totally out of scale for the room. So this is what we did. We brought it out here. We set it up around this dormant fountain for the winter. We added on some metal um, structuring. This is an old metal ornament tree. Uh, these are some plate racks. Um, just some flotsam that we found to give it some nice shape. And then we took cascading curtains and fed them up and again out and, and coming down the fountain. So we've got, uh, again, a second fountain tied into the whole uh, theme without it looking vacant for the winter. Okay, at the entrance here, we used the Aspen wreath, and these are great because they're battery operated, and you can set them for uh, varying amounts of time, six, seven, eight hours. So it'll stay on for that long and then shut off for the next cycle, come on the same day, same time the next day. And this is great um, over the lampshades. We used a little bit of the garland, again, underneath these six foot finials, which we really, we wired down like crazy to make sure they didn't take off in the wind.